Speaking of putting others first, global crowdfunding from Charity.com and the nonprofit CDC Foundation are joining forces to raise money in the fight against COVID-19. Donations raised from the partnership will go to support the emergency response to the pandemic. Joining me now on Skype to talk more about this is Rabbi Yehuda Gerwitz, CEO of Charity.com. Rabbi, welcome to the show. Thank you so much for having me. Well, first off, for many folks who may not be familiar with it, what is crowdfunding and how exactly does it work? So crowdfunding means to raise money from the crowd. Uh, you can do it old school would be probably going door to door mailing. And in the modern age, it's through emails, through any form of raising, but just in a way that you can get a mass message out. Can you tell us a little bit about the theme of this campaign and why this kind of fundraising is so important to the fight against COVID-19? So the CDC Foundation is an independent nonprofit created by Congress to help work with the CDC. And within this campaign specifically, they're working on the front lines, working hand in hand with local and public health officials to solve, prevent, detect, and realize anything that's needed to act as first responders to solve the crisis. And how exactly will this money be used uh, to supplement government funding and what kind of programs will it help? So specifically we'll be helping expanding, again, I do not work for the CDC Foundation, but it will be helping expanding testing, again, prevent, detect and respond, uh, home essentials for people quarantined, and making sure to deploy emergency people, emergency staff on the front lines and on the local level. Rabbi, I'd love to ask you this question. How does your faith play a role in the kinds of projects that you choose to support? And did it factor into your decision to take on this partnership? So absolutely. It's something that uh, the Lubavitcher Rebbe taught us was the sense of responsibility. And just thinking about it was just the holiday of Purim, right in the beginning of this uh, pandemic. And the story of Esther, Queen Esther, and the Jewish people were at risk. And her uncle Mordechai asked her to go beg the king for help. And she was nervous. She said, if I go to the king, I might be killed. So Mordechai tells her uncle, says, Mi odea im si gat la malthus, loosely translated, who knows, that maybe just for this very moment, that you became the queen. So in times like this, I ask myself, why? Maybe it was just everything we built, the technology and resources that we built was just to help with this. And therefore we donate, we, we basically came in and we changed our fees in order to be able to solve and help and give our resources to be able to solve whatever we can. That's really wonderful. Quickly, we only have about 30 seconds left, but I'd like to know if people are interested in helping out, how can they do so? Uh, go to giveforcdcf.org, and it's something amazing that we've seen. There's so many people who have been answering that question and taking on responsibility, getting their friends involved, getting companies. It didn't make a difference if there are $5 donors or $5 million donors. People have been answering and realizing that they have a sense of responsibility to help out. Wonderful. Thank you so much. Rabbi Yehuda Gerwitz, CEO of Charity.com. Thanks again. Thank you.